screwed up. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so let's look at uh, this. Uh... Oh, okay, we'll give some of those to the butterflies. Yeah, some of the orange. Oh, I think we should cut some of those in there and place in the dome. Yes. These oranges, where do they come from? Pongola area? Yeah, Pongola area. Okay. Yeah. So this one was the... The palm wine, actually. We were trying to attract the gold bandage forester. Oh, so you use palm wine? Yes, it was very, very attractive on the palm wine. Okay. As well as banana. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So when, because it's, it's rare to get uh, gold banded forest, so we try some means to, to attract it. Yeah. Because it can smell the, the palm one from a uh, long range. So yeah. So we attract it by putting the palm one here so that it will come closer. Okay. And then you can be able to catch it and then breed it. So you mixed palm wine here and... Uh... It's just palm one only. Okay. You can throw bananas somewhere. Mm -hmm. So that they, she, when she or he comes, she can suck that banana. Okay. After sucking that banana, it's easy for you when you go check. You check and say, oh, there, maybe he's there now. Yeah. And then you, you can be able to catch it using that net. Oh, okay. And yeah. then take to the dome. Take it to the... Um, you can take it to the dome, but uh, yeah. mostly you take it to the breeding room. Mm -hmm. And you put it there because the, in, there is a breeding cage. Yeah. That breeding cage, um, <coughs> that breeding cage, this is where you put butterflies and then you put their own host plants. Okay. And then well, they lay eggs there. And then after laying eggs, they, they comes uh, caterpillars after caterpillars, pupae. Yeah. And then after pupae comes uh, an adult uh, butterfly. So when they are adult there, you take them from the butterfly breeding uh, room and take them to the dome. Okay. Yes, but when you're catching butterflies, firstly you catch butterflies and and put them in a breeding okay. cage, and then from the breeding cage, the breeding room, and then you take them to the breeding cage, from the breeding cage to the dome. Okay. Yes. So in the case where you, if you catch them straight and take them straight to the dome, they won't be able to lay eggs and. They they will be able. It's just that in the dome, uh, they are they are. They are enemies of the butterflies, they, okay. they are plenty, so you need to take it when it's because there are things that eat uh, the eggs of. Uh, yeah. But in the breeding room, it's easy to, to clear everything because the breeding room is not that big. Okay. You can see everything, you check all the, the plants in there, all those host plants, and then you check there are no spiders, geckos, stuff like that. Yeah. And then you, you'll be able to, to see that there are no dangerous okay. stuff against the, the, your butterflies or your eggs. Yeah. Now you with this palm wine, one. What if it gets the butterfly drunk? Because do you so, put sweet palm wine or uh, sour palm palm wine that's already getting a bit sour, sweet or sour? You can put any. What if it gets drunk? The butterfly gets drunk. It will, no, you you won't get drunk because <laughs> <laughs> because it's not like when it is still when we put in here. Yeah. Because the the. the, the the butterfly uses its proboscis to drink. Okay. So it doesn't get into... It drinks only, okay. Yeah, so it's not easy for the butterfly. And then I know the butterfly wants to suck it just to... I'm sure it's to quench thirst and then oh. she will fly away. Okay. Yeah, it's not like she will stick there forever. 